Hey guys, ND Zero Gloves here, and welcome back to another video. Today's video is going to be how to break in a baseball glove. All right, so we're going to be demonstrating with my 44 Pro Signature Series model. It's about this far, barely touches. Okay, and we have the Nakona. We have the Nakona Classic Glove Conditioner. We got the mallet. And we got the skills uh, weighted baseballs. We also got the Wilson ball. Okay. <clears throat> Let's begin. So, when you first get your new glove, it's supposed to be stiff. And, uh, yeah, that's how you knew it's high quality. So, when I got this glove, it was about right here. You could barely squeeze it. And, um, so, yeah. The first thing you want to do is you want to play regular catch. You know what I mean? Okay, so you just want to... Play catch and just see how your glove works. See how you close it. Here's the pocket on this one. So yeah, um, you just want to play some catch. And uh, after you play a round of catch, then you want to hit him with the mallet. It's hard to do it with one hand, guys. But yeah, you just want to hit it right in the palm. I mean, right in the pocket. Develop that nice little pocket. Depending on what size pocket you want, just hit it right in the pocket. This is for a first baseman, by the way. If you want to break in an uh, infielder's glove, you want to hit the break points right here. And also right here. Sorry, guys. I'm a little sick. <clears throat> and then after you hit it with the mallet, you know, wait a, wait a day or two. And then, you know, put some conditioner on it. You just want to lather up some conditioner in the palm. Just a tiny, tiny bit just to get the, the leather all soft. And once you do that, you want to take the weighted ball and then just throw it in there. This is a uh, 12 ounce right here. It's a diesel. Just throw it in there. And this really develops the pocket super fast. These balls are super nice. So yeah, um, <clears throat> so after you do this and you want to play another round of catch with the ball, you know, just play some catch with it, keep developing the pocket, and you just want to repeat this process for as long as you want. <clears throat> I've had this glove for about five months now, but I haven't really worked with it that much, but it's pretty nice. So, um. Yeah, you just want to repeat this process maybe a few months, and then your glove should be really broken in. Yeah, but you also don't want to condition your glove too much, because that could actually damage it. So maybe condition it probably once every couple months, just to get the leather uh, soft. You know what I mean? So, um, yeah, guys. I hope you enjoyed this video. And, uh, sorry for the lack of uploads lately. Indie Zero has been very busy. But, um, yeah. Thanks for watching. Make sure to hit the like button and subscribe. Deuces.